A huge, almost year-long undercover narcotics operation wrapped up today in Flagler County with several dozen arrest warrants, all issued and more than five and a half million dollars worth of drug seized. West Shoes Claire Metz reports the sheriff says Operation Santa's naughty little sellers put a dent in the local drug trade. Many of the tips that we received came in from the community. And the community says Sheriff Rick Staley is fed up with drug sales, drug trafficking that he says often leads to more violent crime. The identified suspects may be loosely connected but are not part of one organized drug ring. The common elements, though, say investigators, is that they are all local people accused of possessing and or selling illegal narcotics. We have seized enough heroin and fentanyl in this operation that has the potential to kill 2.3 million people. Law enforcement also recovered firearms, more than a dozen, and $42,000 in cash. Among those arrested, a father and two sons. In another case, a pair of brothers. Disturbing, says the sheriff, that in some cases, families are in this kind of business together, possibly contributing to the skyrocketing number of overdoses here and around the country. How many lives this operation saved and how many overdoses uh, will not occur because of the drugs that were seized. The sheriff thanked his team who took risks gathering information and evidence and he thanked citizens who saw something and said something. They know when something's wrong in their neighborhood and they call us with that information. 17 of 35 arrests have already been made, the investigation ongoing. The sheriff warns those not yet in custody to turn themselves in or keep looking over their shoulders. In Flagler County, Claire Metz, WESH 2 News. The sheriff says that as his team made some arrests today, one of the suspects took off throwing drugs out of a vehicle. Additional drugs are also found inside of that vehicle.